So it shouldn't surprise anybody to hear that the prices of crypto assets have been down for a very long period of time, basically since November of 2021. And the price of ADA is obviously not excluded from this list. Now, it just came out that there are, in fact, 300, 300, 3 million ADA addresses that are currently in losses. Man, if there was 300 million addresses and losses, that'd be something. But 3, 3 million in losses right now. Now, I would actually consider this to be somewhat bullish, and I want to talk to you guys about why that is. Now, if you're curious about what levels these people have bought in at, here's a kind of a heat map to show you. Quite a few between that 38 to 42 cent range, 42 to 68, 68 to $1.10, $1.10 to $1.45, and so on and so forth. Now, the reason why I say that this is actually bullish is because the people that are in those ranges that purchased and are, are continuing to hold at this time, they're not selling. You saw the biggest outflow of, of you know capital from crypto addresses back in quarter one and quarter two of 2022. Since then, it has been very, very stagnant. It's the reason why the prices haven't really done much. It's the reason why the hold times for assets are so long. When we look at the hold time for ADA, it's one of the, the second, I believe it's the second longest in all of crypto behind Shiba Inu, which is a testament to the strength that currently lies in the I guess, mindset around Cardano holders. They do not want to sell, right? So as we work our way up through these numbers, these different price levels, with this distribution being so even as it is, we're likely to see a very good run in the bull market. Now, there's no guarantee. Obviously, this is not financial advice. We don't know what price is going to do. But it also shows that there isn't going to be this immense sell pressure at certain points. People are okay holding on to their coins and waiting until they're at least in the profit to sell. Now, at that point, they may not liquidate, period. We've talked about time and time again, all the great things that are coming within the Cardano ecosystem, the updates to the wallets, the scalability, right? The interoperability, all these things we talk about a bunch here on the channel are really just beginning to roll out. And a lot of these people now who are continuing to hold through these rough times, while even the price of ADA hasn't necessarily recovered as some of the other market has, they are waiting to see the whole network unfold. They're waiting to see the, the grand story come to fruition. So there's confidence that people can have in what is being built at this time in ADA. And you can also be confident in the fact that the, the weak hands are, are pretty much gone, guys. Okay, We are looking at better times ahead. As always, this is not financial advice. If there is some big macro you know, factor or black swan event that brings the market down. Obviously, there's not really any escaping that. Unfortunately, there's always going to be someone to try to push the price down. But right now, I would argue that there are more people that are bullish on ADA than are betting against it at this time. But I appreciate you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Show your support below. And I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Take care.